Hey guys, welcome back to your girl. This video is an unboxing video for Timu. Have you Timu'd? Um, Timu is kind of like, I mean, not to be comparing companies or anything like that, but you know, the best way to like truly understand if you don't know what Timu is, it is T-E-M-U. It's like Wish. Like I, I know the majority of us have uh, know what Wish is. Or if you want, it's kind of like, Shein too, you know, if you want to go ahead and just throw some companies out there just to give a comparison. So, um, they have a variety of different things. They have things for your home. They have things for clothes. They have, um, you know, for us as crafty folks, they got things like that too. So they have reached out and asked if I can go ahead and collab. And I chose some things. And uh, one of the big things about this company, well. Actually, we'll get into that, but make sure you check down below how the links to the products that I do have um, that we'll be showing today. I honestly can't really remember. <laughs> it didn't take very long to get here. Um, it took maybe about a week. And so that's a plus because, you know, when you are ordering things overseas, it takes a good minute. So um, I'm going to go ahead, cut this bad boy open and I'll show you guys what I got. <laughs> So first off, they have these really cute Timu bags. Now, if you ever order from Shein, um, they have bags that are like this too. They um, are kind of like this and they have Shein on there. So I really, really like these bags. And like, again, for us crafters, we can go ahead and revamp these and use them for our own convenience in some way. Like, you see how big this bag is? Like, for real, let me, I mean, it's bigger than my ruler. That's for sure. So she is roughly at like 17 inches, 18 inches by like maybe 13. So you could go ahead and put like your paper crafts in here. So, or not, like your um, paper craft supplies, like your um, car suck and stuff like that. So that's really, really cool to uh, go ahead and reuse. I'm definitely gonna be doing that. So one of the things I got was some sublimation transfer paper. So I have gotten into sublimation a little bit. I'm not going like balls deep into it, but um, trying different papers and stuff like that, really um, just trying to see like what works and what works best for me. Like I'm still testing everything. I'm not gonna start selling things or anything like that. Now you guys do know I do design stuff. So I'll eventually probably start um, throwing out designs and everything like that, but Sorry, I had to adjust my lighting real quick. That afternoon sun was coming in, so it was like, mm, yeah, yeah, no. <laughs> but, um, but like, once, like, I have, like, the designs or whatever, like, that I might end up start selling, but I'm still playing around with sublimation. I'm no pro. I need to go back and rewatch a lot of, um, Gift Diva stuff, because I'm sure, because that girl, um, to me, is sublimation queen. And, but I do have like most of the tools that I need. But anyways, so this, these are A4 size and they come with 50 sheets. Prices on there are pretty, uh, pretty fantastic. I'll tell you what. But one of the things I was going to say is don't sleep on your cart. Okay. Because, um, when they had reached out to me, like I had put stuff in my cart just to know like what I'm going to go back and like let them know of uh, and everything but then when it, it came down to actually going ahead and um letting them know a lot of the stuff i had in my cart was no longer available like it's sold out so don't sleep on your cart okay if you want it i mean you can probably give it a 24 hour thought but you can't always guarantee that it's gonna be there the next day when you look at it so if you want it go make sure you're paying attention when it says like hey this is popular this is a hot item there's only a few of these left like pay attention to that because it is not lying to you like that stuff will be gone so make sure that you um don't sleep on it go ahead if you want it go ahead and get it so um yeah so i can't wait to test that out and then I got another one of these giant bags. Oh my gosh, I love these bags. I can't wait to just use the bags. I mean, like for real. So let me start pulling this stuff out. All right, so one of the things I got, these. this is that um, wax melt 
um, little thingy. Now, I've actually have gotten a lot better with this. So, let me just show you an example. I've gotten a lot better with my wax melts. But, um, uh, I remember when Crafters Treats was like, oh, you know, you have, they have that little tray or whatever. And so, I was like, okay, I'm going to go ahead and go for it. Now, I'm, I'm wondering if these are, like, adhesive backing. So, like, if you want to make them into stickers, I'm guessing that's probably what these little white dots are for. But that is one of the things I got. And then this here, I think I got multiple things in here. Now, this, um, I don't do diamond painting, but, of course, you know, I play with gems and stuff like that. Now, this is for your, um, like, diamond dots but like you can also utilize them for your gems and everything so it comes with different sections and so you can go ahead and put your gems in there and then when you're done you have them like you have them like this you put the little pieces in and so that they don't escape but when you're done if you have them all plugged up you can go ahead and pour each section at a time out of there so i thought that would be awesome it looks like a little painter's little thing <laughs> but i thought that would be um perfect for like when i am working with gems and everything like i said i don't i have diamond dots but i don't use them for diamond painting but i wanted this to utilize for my gems because a lot of times i'm doing it with different colors and i don't want them being scattered all over the desk so that's what that for they have um different variations they have different colors of these as well so um i'm pretty sure that would be pretty awesome then inside here, ooh, now this is UV resin. Um, I don't like playing with um, resin and stuff because, like, uh, I ain't trying to wait 24 hours. But I did want to try the UV one and see how well I like that. So this is UV resin hard. Um, it's UV curable resin solution hard glue. This is 100 grams. This is the bigger bottle. Um the curing time is with the UV lamp, two to four minutes with sunlight on a sunny day, five to 10 minutes. And then um, sunlight when it's cloudy is 20 to 40 minutes. And then it gives you the instructions. And then of course, you know, your warnings and everything. And then it has your little cap here um, to close it up. So you have your fine tip and then here you go ahead and close that up. So that, I got that. Oh, but wait, there's more. Another bag. So I did get dies. We'll get to that later. We'll get to that stuff later. So I got these heart pouches. These are actually a lot bigger than I thought. These are so cute. These are little heart Ziploc bags. Aren't these cute? And then, like, go ahead and embellish the front of them. And you can just send out some cute little happy mail. Um, this came with, I want to say, 10, maybe? Um, two, four, six, eight. Yeah, 10. And um, different colors. Like I said, that is a lot bigger than what I um, thought they were. So I'm excited. And then here I have this cute, this is the tiniest mailbox ever. It's a cute little mailbox, little treat box. And it um, comes with a um, little die here that says mail. And you have the little flag of, I am a mail carrier, so I went for the mailbox. But look at how cute that is. It's so little. Look, it's not even two inches. This thing is so cute. It's like an inch and a half across. Oh my gosh. That thing is so adorable. I love it. And then um, I have... Oh shoot. Did I accidentally do this twice? I think I actually did this twice. So, but this is a box. <laughs> it's um one. It's like you can do it like a regular um, four-sided square box. Or you can keep adding the pieces to make it like hexagonal or octagonal or whatever. And um, it's a cute little treat box. You have like different like type of hanging things. You have some flowers. You have a heart here. Um, we have like little faux buttons. So this is cute. And you have like your layering pieces for matting. And I didn't mean to get two, but I mean, and then on the outside, they do have the information of what your item is. So that's super cool. And then to go with my little newbie resin here, I got a 
butterfly, not a butterfly, a bow, of course, of course. Um, little mold. Look at how cute that is. Ooh, got some weight to it. It's like really sturdy. Like, I don't know how in the, like, it's not going anywhere. And you see how, like, it's like I'm moving it back and forth. And you can't even, like, shift it off the table. That's cute. And I believe, if I'm not mistaken, these are all the same size. So you can go ahead and make multiples and not have to, like, wait and be like, oh, shoot, you know, only have, like, one small one, medium, large, whatever. Like, they're all the same size. So you can go ahead and do that up. So nice. And then this one is, like, one of those little cone things. Oh, my gosh. This is so much smaller than I thought. It looked bigger in the picture. <laughs> But this thing is still so cute. Like, the picture of it is so cute. It's just, like, you know, just makes a little cone. And I love it. Can't wait to play with that. What else do I have? I have, um, now this is a little silicone tray. I got this to, um, for when I am doing, like, my wax or even for my, um, um, glue gun and it's pretty it's pink and it has flowers like <laughs> that's really all it is so it's just basically that or um on the example it showed like uh, making your wax melt on here too so that's really what that was for super cute and it's pretty and then here what was this what was this oh my little flashlight so this is my uv light my little uv flashlight is there batteries in here already? Okay, so it doesn't come with batteries in there. Oh, wait, it does. Oh, you just had to take the little stopper thingy off, I guess. Comes with a double A battery. Okay, so it's on. It works. Okay, okay, girl. It was kind of hot. <laughs> uh. It says 365, it says it's called Torch. Please take out the battery insulating strip before use. <laughs> this is probably a smart Brittany read things before you um start messing with stuff. <laughs> and then oh wait, I do have another die. This is a cute little wolf bug. <laughs> it's so adorable. Oh my gosh, I can't. <sighs> So this is like three and three quarters wide. <clears throat> you have the windows, you have your wheels, and then you just have like your embellishments to go on top of that. It does come with the layering piece for matting. <laughs> this is so cute. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I love that. And then last but not least, I got like, um, I love these pouches. First of all, I I've, I'm all about presentation on things, but I love these pouches. Now, um, these are little um, bunnies, and um, it's black, white, and pink. Now, now, it does look like you don't really get too much. I mean, I guess it really depends on how much you actually use. But, like, when you bring everything down, it's not that much in there. So, it's kind of like, mm, um, mm. I mean, it was only, like, a you know barely a dollar and some change but i have um gotten things from other places relatively the same where you did you know get a lot more so that's kind of a bummer i will say now see this one same like it's the same thing um but just but of course it goes off weight so it does look like it's a lot more but these are butterflies again black white and pink and but they are a whole heck of a lot smaller so it does look like there is more in this one than the other one but we got to remember to the size of them but i mean i guess it's about the same but yeah it is a little disheartening that it's not that much in there but, eh. and then last but not least i got this piece now these are all like relatively like when you're looking for these these are considered nail art and of course that's not what i'm gonna use them for Now this, um, these are pink and gold and you have different things here. So you have, they're the same on both sides, but they're just, um, different in size. So we have hearts here 
Here we have butterflies, we have flowers, then we have a different style of butterfly, different style of flowers, and then these are the little bunny heads. So these are really, really cute. Let me try to open one without them plopping all over the place. So that is what they look like. Pretty, aren't they? So yeah, so when you are um, when you're wanting something, I, I like having the containers like this. Um, just because it just makes it easier to for storage and to keep everything separated opposed to having bags like this i mean granted i have containers to pour that stuff into but um but when you are looking for things like this like if you can't find it or if it's not bringing up the options that you're looking for then make sure you start typing you type in nail art um like th their dye selection is not very heavy so um if you're only on there to look for dyes eh, i would not um because like i said the selection is not very grand it really all depends on what kind of dyes you're looking for you may not find everything that you are looking for um when it comes to like nail art stuff or like sequins whatever like i said type in nail art and you'll have you'll probably have a better ability of finding the thing that you're looking for they have quite a bit of stuff like this and stuff like this as well and then um things like for the sublimation really wasn't that much so it really depends on what you are uh, truly looking for um they did have quite a bit of molds they had um quite a bit of stuff for, like wax melts and stuff like that so it really varies on what you are looking for so they have a lot in certain categories not so much in other categories but they do have a little bit now i did want one of their mini um heat press and like i said this is what i'm saying like don't sleep on your cart because i had it in my cart for like mm, three days and then when i went to go ahead and set it up it was gone and at that time they only had one color left and but then that bad boy was gone it was like 50 bucks it was like a little mini one and um so that's what I'm saying, like, don't sleep on your cart. If you want something, make sure you go ahead and just order it and call it a day because it probably won't be there in the next couple of hours, let alone the next day. And, um, <clears throat> but yeah, but that is what I got from Timu, my very first order ever from Timu. Thank you so much for reaching out to me. And um, I hope you guys will Timu. <laughs> and again i'll have i'll try to have the links of everything that i have received down below in the description box um if they are sold out of the things that i have i'm sure there'll be other variations of it colors or something along those lines but thanks so much for hanging out with me today guys don't forget to subscribe to your girl and hit that like button and i'll catch you out in the next video bye